Good morning, this is Keith All. In today's Photoshop tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to make a selection and make it transparent. Um, it's a very simple process to do, and just a background story. Let's say you have an image and you just want to make a certain selection of that image transparent. So maybe because you want to create like a, 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 a specific shape or whatever, and then you want to be able to put that uh, shape image onto another website, but you want to be able to put a, um, uh, uh, an image behind that uh, image so it sees through that image. Um, so that's just an example of, of what you could do with this uh, skill set that I'm going to teach you here today. So uh, it's also important that wherever you make the selection, the layers behind it must also be transparent for this uh, to work. So what you want to do is then I just have a regular layer here with an image open here. It's a regular uh, layer. Uh, I'm going to create a new layer. And then I'm going to drag that layer because once you create a new layer, it's transparent. Uh, I'm going to put it below the, my image. And then what I want to do is then um, uh, make my selection that I want to make transparent. So you could use any of the selection tools. I'm going to use the regular uh, rectangular marquee tool to make my selection just like that and now you want to use the eraser tool uh, again there's many different ways you could do this in Photoshop I'm just showing you one way I'm gonna use the eraser tool to erase this selection and what's nice about this um, you could go outside that selection and it won't uh, erase anything so let's erase this whole thing. Okay. Now, all I do is hit Control D to deselect the selection. And now you're ready. You could actually save this file as or export this file as a PNG uh, because PNG accepts transparency. Uh, a JPEG does not. So you could save this and then you could place this image anywhere and then um, on your website you could put it up on your website and then you could put an image behind this current image and that uh, image will show through this selection so just to show you that it does work right now instead of saving it what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bring up an image and I'm gonna drag it over here onto my canvas and right now it's sitting on, on top of my layer so what I want to do is I want to drag it below my image layer right here so I'm going to drag it below here and see you can see uh, that it's transparent so if I use the move tool I can adjust it any way I want to so it appears within the selection that I made and as you can see behind that it's transparent so I could just set it right there and you're good to go so hopefully this tutorial was very helpful for you today to help you learn how you could set a certain selection in your image to be transparent uh, remember to subscribe to my channel and uh, click on that bell notification so you always get updated when I do new tutorials uh, always uh, uh, like, share, and comment on my videos too because it helps uh, my channel out a lot and it helps other people learn too. So thanks again for stopping by and you have a great day.